This is a lesson on chord families and a couple new chords. We're going to be talking about the C, F, A minor, and G7 chords today and their respected chord group and families. So first we're doing the C major, third finger, third fret of the A string, bottom string. This is a C major. Major chords are generally happy and very sturdy. You can play them for a long time. Um, Next, we're going to talk about the A minor. A minor, you're going to use your second finger on the second fret of the top string, the G string. Once you get that, then you're going to move to the F chord. Uh, the F chord is your first finger on the first fret of the E string, the second finger on the second fret of the A string. G7, which is going to be your first finger on the first fret of the E string, second finger, second fret of the C string, third finger, second fret of the A string. And just practice going in that chord progression. So C, A minor, F, G7. Practice those chords as slow or as fast as you want. I recommend starting slow so that your chord transitions are cleaner. Uh, now, um, we're gonna talk about the chord families. So C is a part of the major chord family. It's a very happy chord, um, pretty sturdy, and um, typically your major chords are very bright and cheery like this. Uh, next is the minor chord, A minor. Minor chords are more sad, um, emotionally than a major chord. They just have that tone to it. Um, so you can use that to make some emotional variety in your music. Um, then F is another major chord. Back to kind of bright and cheery. And then we have a G7, which is also known as a G dominant seven. Um, basically, this is kind of a, what we would call a transition chord. So it makes it feel really good when you get back to the main chord, which is C. You can hear it kind of like wants to go there. So those are transition chords typically with dominant seven. So C major, A minor, F major, and G seven. Hope that was helpful. Uh, play those chords as slow or as fast as you want. And uh, put any questions that you might have in the comments and I will answer them as soon as I can. Subscribe to the channel uh, for more of these videos.